guys, I'm back for another video and this week I'm going to be showing you my three favourite brow products from Maybelline and how to use them. First I'm going to start with my Brow Precise Micro Pencil. So this is a pencil that can really just define that brow, define that arch. It's got a really nice little spoolie on the end of it so it can also um, soften the whole brow out as well. I'm going to show you how I like to do it myself. You can have it quite defined but for me I like it to be a little bit more defined on the ends and then bit more natural if anything. So I'm only going to do it on this brow first but I like to start from the middle of the brow and I'm just going to draw in strokes, just little soft strokes. Also one of the best ways to, to do brows is to look downwards into a mirror. So I'm just following the line where my hairs actually stop. I'm not going further than that because I don't want my brows to be thicker but you can if you'd like to. But in the front bit I'm only feathering in little strokes. I then use this spoolie on the end of the brush to push the brow hairs down and I just fill in the little gaps just bit by bit. You can even draw like bigger strokes if you'd like to get just a, like a little definition there. And then I'm going back and pushing up the hairs with the spoolie part and just setting them in place. So that's one brow. It's more of a defined look but it's so easy to do and it's such a great colour. It doesn't look too unnatural. So yeah. So this is my next favourite product, it's the Master Brow Pro Palette. Um, it has three different products in it, so it has a gel brow product, and then it has a powder one, and then it has an, a highlight for underneath the brow. But first of all, I like to go in with the powder with an angled brush. I would normally use the brush that would come in the actual box, but I've lost it. Again, you're going to start from like the middle of the brows at the bottom, and you're going to line it off. So I'm doing little strokes and then with the rest of the product I push it up towards the top of the brow. And then here with the rest of the product you can kind of just buff it out so that it won't be too harsh in this, um, the inner bit of the brow as well. And then on top you can do little strokes on top of the brows to get that definition on the hairs. So yeah, you can see the difference of these two brows. This one's a little bit more filled in, um, a little bit softer, but it still has its thickness to it. This one is more defined and it's got the thin strokes to it. It's totally up to you, but this one's more full and this one's more defined. <laughs> Okay, now I'm going to go in with my Tattoo Brow Gel Tint, and this is in the shade Medium Brown. So I've only taken this brow off, I've left that one on, just to show you the comparison of both, I guess. But yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and start from the middle of the brow again. Be really careful with this stuff because remember it's a tint. Okay, so that's um, all the stuff on the brow. I'm just going to let it sit for like three minutes or something and then I'm going to take it off. So it's been a little bit longer than 20 minutes now and I just started to peel this off <laughs> in the mirror um, and that's when you know it's ready when it can literally peel off so easily. So the amazing thing about this is it doesn't hurt your hair at all. It's, it looks like it's pulling it a little bit because it is but it doesn't hurt it at all. Okay so I've taken all of that one off. You can see it just leaves a really nice natural tint. It really didn't affect this area in the front in like a harsh way but it gave it that subtle I guess tint to the brow which it needed. My brows are already really dark anyway so <laughs> it wasn't going to make them darker, it just kind of makes the skin darker if anything. Thank you so much for watching my video today, I really hope you liked my three little products that I used today. Make sure you go and try them yourself because they're seriously so amazing and they last a really long time. Please remember to subscribe and to like and to comment what video you want to see me do another time and yeah thanks so much for watching, bye guys!